Hi guys, so today I will be sharing with you my online finals week experience in Cebu Institute of Medicine. Now, the footage that you're about to see are the clips that I took in between exams and then there are some uh, b-rolls just to fill in the whole story. Now, full disclaimer first, the contents including the opinions and views expressed on this video are entirely personal and do not reflect the opinions and views of anyone else including the other faculty, student or staff in my department or of the Cebu Institute of Medicine. CIM has not approved and is not responsible for the material contained in this video. I'm going to apologize ahead for the instances wherein I do not really have the mood to take the video and then I just did it for the sake of documentation. Uh, nevertheless, here are the clips. Enjoy! Today is July 5, 2021 and it's day one of final exam week. We'll be having our internal medicine final exam later at 2 p.m. And what I'm doing right now is I'm just trying to document the whole process of the final exam week and sharing my thoughts about the exam and the preparation that I've done and maybe doing a little b-roll of my studying. So uh, this will be my first online final exam because when I was first year we didn't have a final exam. It was just the fourth by monthly. So as you can see here, we're at we're at this date. We're at we're at final exam set A, internal medicine. It should be followed by micro para tomorrow. So uh, we'll be going through the final exams together and then let's see how that goes. So right now I'm going to go back studying with some notes and then maybe I'll talk to you later once the exam is near. 146, 15 minutes, about 14 hours before the exam starts. It's time to get ready. So, I just finished taking internal medicine exam. It's currently uploading the monitoring file right now. Uh, what I feel about that exam, I don't know what to feel actually. Then there were questions that were completely new to me. Maybe I forgot about them. Maybe I wasn't able to review. But in all, compared to the PDA exam, uh, this one was relatively easier compared to the PDA exam. Uh, so I don't know what to feel really. But at least it's over. So now, that's one down, three more to go. Before we go to the next day, you might be wondering what program we use for our exams. We use Examplify. It's a program that locks your computer, records what you're doing, so that the facilitators can ensure that you're taking a secure exam. Now, on to day two. It's day two of finals week. Uh, as you can see here, we're at July 6. Uh, we'll be taking the micro, par microbiology, parasitology, and immunology uh, final exam. Also, uh, something arrived yesterday all the way from uh, North Carolina, Westlake, Charlotte, North Car Carolina. It's from our friends at Thick Money. So they gave me this free shirt and let's try it out. So this is the free shirt. Uh, you can see there's a Picmonic logo here, and then it's written over here the word Picmonic. So, to my friends at Picmonic, thank you. Thank you for this free shirt. 
if you want to know more about Pygmonic, it's basically a app for creating picture mnemonics. So they have a library wherein certain topics they create picture mnemonics for you. If you want to know more about Pygmonic, I created a video here. Uh, just click the link there if you want to know more about this app. So again, thank you Pygmonic for this feature. Now I'm going to eat lunch and then review a bit uh, since the exam is at 2 p.m. And then I'll see you after the exam. As usual, wish me luck. And if you're wondering what's the purpose of this uh, mirror, this is for uh, the Exemplify program that we're using uh, so that the facilitators, facilitators can see what's uh, within our perimeter beside us if we are cheating or not. So, uh, I'm done taking the micro exam. Yes, uh, it was hard. It was challenging uh, compared to the IM1. Uh, micro definitely was uh, more difficult. So, if you rank the four finals, four final exams, that would be your IM. Uh, IM would be the second, and then the most challenging out of the four, as of now, would be the micro because uh, the exam was maybe because of the amount of content or uh, some tricky, tricky questions and then also the exam contained pictures so uh, it it really it really applied our uh, laboratory knowledge in in our micro in taking this exam and then cases and then it had pictures and then you would identify what the parasite or Yes, what the parasite was or what the bacteria was. So there's that. I think that would be all for the microbiology exam. So at least we have two down, two more to go. We're halfway there. Uh, tomorrow I'll be having my pharma review because we have a one day break before uh, the Thursday and Friday exams, which would be pharma and uh, pathology. So, so right now, what I'm planning to do is work out and then review some Anki Pharma afterwards. So, I'll see you. July 7, day 3 of finals week, which is currently a study study day or let's say a break day currently at here. You can see that. So uh, they gave us a one day break before our pharma and patho exam. So today I'll be reviewing some pharma cards since I'm not really that confident with pharmacology. There's nothing really interesting happening today aside from the studying. 
So uh, I'll get back to you tomorrow or before our pharma exam. <laughs>